Problems 1 and 2 together illustrate that the graph of an offspring function of the parent cubic function y equals x cubed has only one x-intercept. The graph of the cubic function y equals x cubed minus 2x squared minus 5x plus 6 has three x-intercepts. You cannot obtain this function or others like it by transforming the parent cubic function y equals x cubed using stretches, reflections, and translations. Similarly, some quartic functions are simple transformations of y equals x to the fourth power, and some are not. Problem three, constructing a quartic function with two real zeros. What is a quartic function with only two real zeros, x equals five and x equals nine? Method one, we can use transformations. So first, we'll find a quartic with zeros at plus or minus two. If we translate the basic quartic, y equals x to the fourth power, 16 units down, we'll note y equals x to the fourth becomes y equals x to the fourth power minus 16. Nine is seven units to the right of two, so we translate seven units to the right. So our function, y equals x to the fourth minus 16, becomes y equals the difference x minus seven to the fourth power minus 16. So a quartic function with its only real zeros at five and nine is y equals the difference x minus seven to the fourth power minus 16. Method two uses algebraic methods. Given real zeros of x equals five and x equals nine, we can write y equals x minus five, the binomial, times x minus nine, another binomial, times some remaining polynomial function q of x. We'll make q of x a quadratic with no real zeros. We can now rewrite this as x minus five times x minus nine times our quadratic q of x having no real zeros, x squared plus one. Note its zeros would be complex. Multiplying to write in standard form, we get x squared minus 14x plus 45 times x squared plus one, and finally, x to the fourth power minus 14x cubed plus 46x squared minus 14x plus 45. So another quartic function with its only real zeros at five and nine is y equals x to the fourth power minus 14x cubed plus 46x squared minus 14x plus 45. Your turn, part A. What is a quartic function, f of x, with only two real zeros, at x equals zero and x equals six? And part B, a reasoning item. Does the quartic function, the negative of f of x, have the same zeros? Explain.